so now i will show you different different application available inside apps so here i'll uh, go through that apps as i show you the survey and set out option the next option will be offset as we know where the measurement physical measurement is not possible and we are having some data with us we can take that offset value and input with some coordinate so it will be stored at offset point for that we are coming back to single distance offset here you can see first you have to input that point id and you have to input that offset value like two meter then you have to choose the left option or right offset or up or down whatever you need you can uh, select that things so then you have to take target that things and you have to take a distance after taking distance you have to click ok so your data will be safe if you click shift button you can see that coordinate with you if you are satisfied with that coordinate you can store that coordinate I am changing that point id so it can be stored so it will be storing <coughs> there are other options available angle offset double distance offset if you need you can do uh, take a practice of that like angle offset like double distance offset one distance from uh, first target point another distance from second target point so if you you can do it like that then other option will be fourth option will be missing line measurement as you see suppose if you have some uh, point and taking some distance and moving to others point and take MLM so basically the thing is that uh, a inside MLM it will measure point to point distance horizontal distance vertical distance and slope distance suppose if you have uh, two known coordinate you can find it out uh, their relative distance bearing sloping gradient all these things by using mlm method so now i'll show you the remote elevation option suppose if you are going to some uh, measure some uh, building height or some light post height what you have to do you have to first target the base of that instrument then take a distance now click REM if you click REM your height will be 1.3 because we are putting uh, that height of target is 1.3 if I'm moving my uh, telescope to the object you can see here the HD height of target will be appear automatically <coughs> if you'd like to stop you can stop it over here and you can uh, repeat that option now come back to area option for area you have to there are two options available you can input some coordinate as your own or you can come back to survey and take some measurement just take some measurement now if you click value now if you click calculate here you can see your area total area as per your survey here another option available for this section if you have some two known coordinate you cannot fix that uh, your instrument on the top of your known coordinate so you have to choose the resection option inside resection as you know you have to input some uh, first point value then you have to measure then you have to input second point value then you have to measure and other option will be reference line as you see there will be many option available inside reference line then coming back to road option inside road you can <coughs> define some road you can set out some road points you can align some road you can align some vertical alignment you can transfer that data thank you